All right, dragon, where are you at, homie? Oh, there you are. Damn. That is a beautiful dragon. All right, let's do this. Let me drink my little potion. All right, let's go. Let's mark him. Stealth. Hidden blades. Not bad, we did decent damage, decent. Damn, I wish I could sprint. Here, let's throw some bees at him. All right, get my energy up, cooldowns are almost back up. Oh my gosh, I gotta get out the water, I gotta get out the water. He electrified the water. Okay, okay. All right, homie. Chill for a second. All right, stealth, hidden blades. Whoops, I didn't mean to pause. There we go. We did a good chunk of his health. We got him running. <laughs> we got him running. All right, buddy. You need to stop shooting this electric shit at me. I guess I should stay out of the water. All right. It's getting close. Mark, stealth, hidden blades. Damn, stop walking away. Messing up my timing. All right, we popped it. All right, one more combo and he's dead. <laughs> Look, the buster's already flying away. He knows what's up. Damn, he's electrifying all the water. Okay, this is awkward. All right, let me pop another potion just in case. Oh my gosh, this potion goes fast. All right, good to know. All right, mark him, stealth. Oh, dead. Got him. <laughs> we soloing dragons out here, baby. Welcome to the Pluto Lounge, where we just chill. What happened here? And where is the merchant we intended to meet? These are good questions. Let's find out what happened. I'm stuck. Letter to a slaver, Zagar. Cancel that order for more field workers. Get me scribes, library slaves, the smartest you can find. They have to be able to read and write. Former runaways are fine so long as they were clever about it. This venatory leader, Calpurnia, is paying a fortune for our best and brightest stock. Deliver to her personally. Don't ask me why. One thing, don't send any with brands or whip marks. We had a couple branded slaves in the last shipment. Her people sent the couriers back with burns on their faces. They said Calpurnia doesn't take kindly to damaged stock. Strange tick for a magister, but her gold's good enough. Vicinius. It seems Vicinius angered Calpurnia by sending her mistreated slaves. Was that mercy or anger at damaged stock? She was paying a fortune for literate slaves. A horde of these venatories not enough? Something's up. That sounds like recruiting to me. It does. Let's find that out. But in the meantime, let's kill all the slavers. tight in here, isn't it? <laughs> Damn, these guys are tanky, aren't they? Oh, 
Damn. That must have been Vicinia. I see Calpurnia sent Venatori to deal with him. Let's look around. The crystal's whole again, but... Hold on. Lady Calpurnia, I had no intention. I warned you of consequences should the slaves you bring me suffer in your care. Venatori, show him my displeasure. No! Wait! Wait! That's a dwarven memory crystal. The Shaper used them to store memories. Don't ask me how. Dagna might know what to make of it. Your trip to the merchant's home yielded results. Before she became leader of the Venatori, Calpurnia was a slave from Minrathus. Even slaves with magic are treated unkindly in Tevinter. If Corypheus freed her, no wonder she follows him. She must believe freedom will reign under Corypheus. Perhaps. Calpurnia has freed every slave she's purchased. Vicinius tracked his shipments. My agents will investigate. This may lead us to Calpurnia's lair. In the meantime, speak to Dagna. The crystal you found on Vicinius fascinates her. This is an amazing find, Inquisitor. The Shaperid and Orzammar had something like it. Greetings to you too, Dagna. They preserve voices, or a likeness. Memories, you know? You don't know. It doesn't matter. The Venatori cracked it, but here... These documents you found, Inquisitor. I've made interesting... <laughs> Have the fear of demons. But the power will draw them unless you have wards against possession. Once you have become the vessel, demons will be beneath your concern. Prepare as I have directed. I shall, Elder One. The crystal couldn't take anymore. It wasn't meant for this. That looked like Corypheus and Calpurnia. It was a memory stored in the crystal. No. That was vital information. Did you see Calpurnia's expression? Their alliance may be less than harmonious. Corypheus said Calpurnia was going to be a vessel. A vessel for what? They spoke of power and demons. But Calpurnia is already a magister. Corypheus must have some other plan. The crystal showed us Calpurnia hasn't bought into Corypheus's myth just yet. Well, I'm no shaper, but I might be able to get it to remember new sounds. Really? If we hid it among Calpurnia's belongings, imagine what we could learn. Huh. I can split it and keep half here. We could hear her speaking right then. It's not how they're supposed to work, and it'll probably break. As I said, I'm no shaper. Inquisitor, Calpurnia's Venatori have been digging up elven ruins. Tracking them might lead us to her. If this crystal were placed in a lair, I cannot overstate the value of what we might learn. Why not attack Calpurnia head on? You attract attention, Inquisitor. Her spies would see you coming. A single agent may slip in and out without notice. This crystal may yield great rewards. Right, simple. Dagna, any chance it'll work? Oh, there's always a chance. I mean, yes. If there's a rift growing between Corypheus and Calpurnia, we must exploit it. I'll have the crystal ready soon. I think. Let me find the Quicksilver. Have we smuggled the other memory crystal into Calpurnia's camp? We have. Here. Oh, even honey can't sweeten Philandris. I'll keep trying. You are no slave, Linnea. I'll add another spoonful myself, later. Calpurnia seems to be treating her new acolytes kindly. While I found that interesting, this is what you must hear. Master, forgive me. I didn't expect. The time for your ascension is. Tell me of your preparation. They go well enough. 
although I've distracted him. If I could train at the shrine. Only Dumont's faithful may enter. Continue as before. Or would you see the Imperium's rebirth stalled by your lack of focus? I will be ready, as the vessel, and Tevinter's champion. Calpurnia sounds like she's doing this for Tevinter, not Corypheus. Another deflection. Why, a dwarf and bauble, as if mine was miraculously returned to me. Let's give your new owner a glimpse of her fate. Venatori, we leave. That is all the crystal recorded before she found it, but I think it may be enough. A shrine to Dumat, Corypheus said. Where Calpenia is forbidden to go. Who is this Dumat that Corypheus mentioned? An old god, worshipped in ancient Devinter as the Dragon of Silence. He was the first to rise as an archdemon and bring the blight. Truly a god fit for Corypheus. If that shrine is Corypheus' inner sanctum, I want in. Perhaps he believes the shrine is sacred. More likely, he's hiding something from Calpurnia, and she suspects it. Let us investigate this shrine, carefully. I doubt Corypheus has left it unguarded. Investigate the Shrine of Dumat, Charter. Between research of our Tevinter text, reports recovered from the Venatori, and casual questioning of the local villages, I believe we have tracked down the Shrine of Dumat. Unfortunately, Corypheus is diligent about keeping his secrets. The opening to the shrine is surrounded by traps of a design we've never seen before. There is no alternative. To breach the shrine, we will have to trigger the traps to learn their function. We have, we may suffer losses, but the information inside will be invaluable. I leave it to you to choose who to send on this mission, Liliana. All right, let's do it. So this is the shrine Corypheus hid from Calpurnia. There are similar places in Tevinter. Notice how you feel it in the back of your mind. There's power here, or was. It is far, far too quiet. Shrines are bad. Who here doesn't know that? <laughs> Damn, the atmosphere of this looks pretty dope. Ow. Alright, let's ride. Damn it. The Crystal. Awake in a world twisted into perversion and ruin. Awake only to discover the light. These are more memory crystals. Corypheus was recording his thoughts. Okay, since I decided to run away from the memory crystal and <laughs> just read the subtitles to you, see what they said. <laughs> P 
Pop Goes the Weasel. a dozen pride demons. What is this? Who are you? Magister Erasthenes, am I a scholar of Timinta? To Corypheus, I am bound to answer every question. Gersenius, <coughs> I am lost. Corypheus did this to you, on Calpurnia's behalf. She knows not how fault. I am a ruin, the jeweled husk when the butterfly leaves. I was the greatest scholar of the old gods in Minrathus. No, in the Imperium. One night, he came to my door. For my relics, I thought, my writings and runes. But instead, my slave went to his side, Calpurnia, to become the vessel and save Tivinta. If Calpurnia is this vessel, what are the contents going to be? I do not know. It, it must be some sort of power. Power like Athemius, risen in flame and... Is that why Calpurnia joined Corypheus? To save your empire? Yes, she seeks a leader, Corypheus, to shape Tevinta's rebirth. Oh, oh. She would raise up the slaves as, as she was raised. Bring a new order with, with a heart of steel. She could do it if she were not the vessel. If Calpurnia is the one Corypheus wanted, why do this to you? For practice. I, Corypheus, crafts a vessel for whatever power he seeks. Yes. But he does not need his vessel to have free will. About her, these same chains will fall. I am to cage lightning. My binding is the poor pencil sketch. Campania will be the masterpiece. She'd reconsider being Corypheus' pet magister if she found out. Hers is a cold rage to rival the wrath of Corypheus. Oh, this chain has broken me, friend. No wings can raise my mind. Please, breach the circle. Its wards will trigger. I will be dust and light, free. Or it will kill us. Corypheus is not above placing such a trap. Corypheus' circle will hold its destruction within. Tight, tight. No fear, only freedom. All right. You seem honest, and you've suffered enough. Light a lamp, would you? All right, interesting. So I guess our next objective is to turn Capernia against Corypheus. You know, killing two birds with one stone. I can dig it. 